Kiss a kiss me in the morning. Kiss a kiss a kiss me in the night. A kiss a kiss a kiss me in the daytime. Kiss a kiss me all the time. Hold me, hold me, hold me, darling. Hold me, hold me, really tight. Kiss me, hold me, hug me, darling, with all your might. Kiss me, hold me. Kiss me, hold me, hug me, darling, with all your might. Kiss me, hold me, hug me, darling, with all your might. I want to lay down by the fire with you where souls are glowing ever warmer too your love surrounds me like a lullaby singing softly you are mine oh my moon has never glowed this color Hearts have never been this close I have never been more certain I will love you till we're old And maybe the night holds a little hope for us Dear, maybe we might want to settle down Hearts have never been this close I have never been more certain I will love you till we're old Maybe the night holds a little hope for us Dear, maybe we might want to settle So once again, ladies and gentlemen, a very good morning to each and everyone and welcome here to the beautiful place of the Garden Oasis. Well, today, mga kaibigan, we're all gathered here for some celebration, of course, for the birthday party of a Tony who won a Wala pang mga kamay power birthday celebrator. Come on, everyone. 
We'd like to invite attorney. Attorney, join us here. Can you join us here on stage for a while? Dito muna tayo, come on. And of course, tonight, uh, at this moment, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to present to you our birthday celebrator who invited us for today's event. Wala bang mga kamay for our birthday celebrator? Palakpakan po natin. Sa mga kaibigan ng ating birthday celebrator. And of course, perhaps a mini reunion para sa lahat ng mga pam uh, pamilya na nandito ngayong hapon. Now, of course, ladies and gentlemen, once again, bigyan po natin ng isang masigabong palakpakan na ating birthday celebrator. A round of applause. Happy, happy birthday, Tony. So at this moment, we're going to start the celebration with the sumptuous food that we have prepared for everyone, okay? But meanwhile, while we are setting up the meals, we are now inviting everyone to please stand up on your feet because we're gonna sing a birthday song for our birthday celebrator. So, manindog tang tanan, everyone. Let's all stand. Maraming maraming salamat. Na mga kaibigan, let's clap our hands as we sing the birthday song. DJ, hit the music. Everybody, let's all sing. Come on. Sabay, sabay. Happy birthday to you. Come on, you. everybody sing. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. There you go. Now let's sing it a little bit faster and louder. Happy birthday candle on your cake, so you need to blow the candle. Ready? In three, two, one, blow. There you go. Palapakan natin the birthday celebrator. <laughs> In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Father, at the outset, let me thank you for this great blessing. The blessing of each one of us to be present in this meaningful family reunion and birthday celebration. There is the true and genuine happiness than to be with your father and mother brothers and sisters, and your kin. Plainly because there is only one thing in common among them, and that is the blood that flows from each one of the family, members of the family. Are the summation of the genes that comes from the father and the mother. Thus the saying, blood is thicker than water, is undeniably or undeniably captures the deep meaning of the saying Father bless us remain with us always that as we journey later in our separate ways we are still confident in one spirit that live in us as we go our way and at this point, we ask you to bless the fruit of our labor because of your generosity. May this food strengthen us to save your people and more so to save you. Bless us, O Lord, in this the gifts we are about to receive from your bounty through Christ, our Lord. Amen. Sana'y di tayo magbago Kailanman, nasan may ito ang pangarap ko Makuha mo pa kayang ako'y hakan at yakapin Sa pagtanda natin Nagtatanong lang sa'yo Ako ba kaya ipigin mo Kung maputi na ang buhok ko
Alright, there we go. Now we're back for the second part of our celebration. Now, of course, sa lahat ng mga bagong dating, welcome right here at the Garden Oasis function. And today, you know what, mga kaibigan, at this moment, we would like to welcome all the people who traveled miles away just to be on this birthday celebration. Palakpakan po natin, marami daw mga tagamid sayap karong hapo na. Palakpakan natin. Hello there, welcome to Davao. At sa lahat ng mga kabarkada at kapamilya ng ating birthday celebrator, daghan kayong salamat sa pagtambong. We prepared some surprises para sa lahat ng mga guests na nandito ngayong gabi, ah, ngayong hapon. And part of that is a special song number that we're about to witness right here at the very stage. Along with this be very beautiful lady na nandito ngayong hapon to give us a good song para sa lahat. Na mga kaibigan, she's celebrating her 18th birthday on August 28th. So mga kaibigan, let's give a big hand our future debutant. A round of applause for Miss Antea. Cause you are the reason I'm 
losing my sleep Please come back now There goes my mind racing And you are the reason That I'm still breathing I'm hopeless now Climb every mountain and swim every ocean just to be with you and fix what I've broken. Oh, cause I need you to see that you are the reason. Uh, ang joke nga namin sa Comelec noon, uh, nung lumipat ako sa Department of Justice, naging mga ano na sila, Provincial Election Registrar and parin dyan, uh, retired as the Regional Director of Region 12. Kaya yung anak ko naka-answer. Kay, I whispered to her that his last job. Um, Parin Jani and Marie Lucy are very lucky. They have uh, five accomplished children. Uh, I think all of them are here. And uh, in, his, uh, in the September of his life, I wish him all the luck and all the happiness with his children and his grandchildren. May God shower more healthy years for him and for the family. Thank you very much. Thankful kami na 89 si Tatay Ara pa. Because we lost our mother at 17 years ago to the big sea. So, thank you kay Ara si Nanay, ah si Tatay. Although uh, professionals na kabitanan, but still, kinanglanggya po namun siya. Uh, to guide us, Mag uh, gather sa amoni. We have uh, reason to gather together, including my uh, cousins, mga relatives, and then uh, I make this uh, a message short. Thank you for coming, and then thank you, Gid kay Nanay kag kay Tatay. Kung ano kami subong. Thank you and good afternoon, Uncle. Happy birthday. <laughs> si Nanay ang eh, tatlo sila nga magutod ni Uncle. Si Nanay gid ang eldest Trinidad Agudo Halipa. Ang second si Auntie Suling Sulidad Agudo Maribuho. As far as I am concerned, Basi sa story ni Nanay sa Amun, nga si Uncle, before siya nag eskwela ng pagka-abogado, nag, hindi ko lang ma-check kung ilang taon siya nag-enroll ng engineering. Pero talagang hindi niya kaya eh. So, Uncle shift to law na ano, nagustuhan na, na talaga niya. At saka, parang, as far, uh, sa aking pagka-understand na si Uncle ay naging editor-in-chief yata ng ano, yung kanilang school paper sa University of San Agustin. Hanggang sa, naging successful lawyer siya at, at saka naging full-pledged attorney. Then, ano, yung before siya na ano, naging ator, yung bilang empleyado ng Comilec na ano ito, yung he is very, very good employer at saka mula noon hanggang ngayon kahit na siya ay retired uh, Comelec officer, talagang kilalang kilala siya sa mga, ano, sa mga tao. Kahit na kung minsan, 
based sa aking experience na ano, yung nag-apply ako ng ano, nag-apply ako sa Comlec ng Kidapawan, talagang dahil <laughs> agudo ang aking middle name, talagang kilalang kilala siya nga, kaano-ano ba ninyo si ano, si attorney? Ano siya, uncle ko siya dahil siya ay bunsong kapatid ng nanay ko. So, sa, napapansin ko talaga na si uncle ay napaka, he is a good husband at saka father sa mga anak niya. At saka hindi lang din sa mga, sa kanyang sariling pamilya. Ngunit para na rin sa aming mga pamangkin niya. He is really a very thoughtful, very good uncle. Again, Uncle, <laughs> naging, <laughs> naging, part na nin, na, naging part ka na talaga sa amin dahil kahit kami ay kami ay ni orphan na rin sa ama way back 1983. Kahit malayo kayo sa amin, Uncle, but every time na ganitong mag- Sama-sama tayo, naging, para ka na rin, ano, naging tatay namin. Maraming salamat, Uncle. And magandang hapon sa lahat. And recognition. Uh, ang history nila ni tatay, uh, si tatay, kag, uh, tatlo kautod ni tatay, tatlo sila magutod. Uh, anak sila sa second family. So, may ara si tatay sa half uh, sister kag bro- sisters kag brothers. So, ang first na wife ni tata, uh, ni Lolo, Lolo Victorino is uh, uh, Villanueva ang apelyedo. So, nabalo si Lolo. Bali, may apat si Lolo ka as bata, uh, Auntie Rusing Buenaflor, Angelina Fuente, Agudo Fuentes. Then may duha ka boys, pero hindi na lamang ito naabtan. They were named Alfredo and Antonio. So, amo na ang bata sa first family. Then si Lolo, nag-asawa sa kay Caridad Butavara. So, ang bata niya, si Auntie uh, Trining. So, Trinidad uh, Agudo Halipa. And then, si Auntie Suling, Solidad, Agudo, uh, Maribuho, tapos si Tatay. So, ang lola daw namon to na si Caridad uh, Botavara, gingather niya ang tanan nga bata ni Lolo sa first wife. Tapos, ginupod niya ang mga bata sa second wife. There was a time na nag-istorya ganing niya, si Auntie Rusing Buenaflor, kag si Auntie Trining Halipa were staying sa lola ni Auntie Rusing para mag eskwela kay mas malapit ang balay sa lola ni Auntie Rusing sa eskwelahan. So, uh, hindi niya ni siguro sikreto sa family. We did not know nga si Auntie Rusing kasi si Auntie Rusing na lang ang nabalaan na nakikita namun nga buhi. So, si Auntie Rusing, we did not know nga half sila ni tatay because nakita namon very close silang apat. Three sisters and si tatay. So si tatay ang youngest, tatlo kababae nga, eld, nga older sa iya. There was a time, uh, ining pakaisa namon na si Judge Renato Fuentes, he is the son of... Uh, Angelina Fuentes, pero si Auntie Angelina hindi na namo na abtan kay daw masakiton kuno to siya napatay siya. So si tatay, si tatay uh, is I think older, six years older sa kay Manong Rene. So sang time nga nagagrow sila, gagmay pa sila, so obdanay sila. Do playmate sila tapos si tatay pa kuno ang nagaligo kay Manong Rene. Bago kay upod sila mo. Tapos our eldest uh, cousin is uh, ang bata ni ano ni ni Auntie Rosing, si Edmundo Benaflor Agudo. So amo na kung paano ang relationship sa uh, family, two families because nga sang tigula ang mga tigulang namon sang una were very close. 
So bali gin para sina si Lola namon gin gather niya ang tanan nga bata ni Lolo so first family ka gin upod niya nakita namon they were really close nga kung mag birthday ang isa ara ang isa do ka close bala sa ila nga even we did not know nga they were half uh, sisters or brother kay wala gina namon nakita sa ila so until now i'm happy nga ari diri tanan akong mga pakaisa Although ang iban wala diri, pero at least each one of them, each family, my representative. So amo na amon nga gina purpose nga gina gather para mag uh, ano ni mag asta subong maski wala na mga tigulang intak mang gyapon. On the other side naman ang parehas nga family ari man diri. Although si nanay namon was uh, uh, naggo na sa heaven 17 years ago, but still we are still maintaining that good relationship nga kung pwede man lang uh, mahimo na mo ni kada tuig para maano bala ma, ma renew ma renew sa ilo-ilo <laughs> oh, ma renew di bala nga bala ko ilonggo papulik ka ano ma renew ka oh, na, that's it so amo na siya so thankful gila ako nga ari tanan-tanan so kung hindi na mo ni mahimo then hindi natun mag-gather ang family members, no? Maski mga pinsan, lang hindi gano'n ako mapati, may mga apo na ako sa pinablos. So, hindi ko na sila makita, hindi ko sila makilala. Okay, ama ng history sa family. Tuli ako, ang pangalan ko is Antonio Agodo Buenaflor. Hindi rin na kami sa family ko, gariside sa Dabao. Ako ang ikaapat nga bata ni Resurrection Buenaflor. So, si Angkol, natandaan ko sa unas ang gamay pa kami, kada bakasyon sa sa amo na sa Reste sa ala, sa Alamada no so uh, uh, adikto sila nakita ni Auntie Lucy kay pharmacist na muna si Auntie Lucy ang unang istorya <laughs> so s'yempre masking sa Iloilo sila dahil mga eskwelahan s'yempre ang muna ginatawag nga soulmate so ang cool belated happy birthday ha? Tapos siguro siya, siguro sa edad niya, buo na na eh, 88 years old something, no? So, kung sa kuwan pa, last month standing, si Uncle Wanso. So, ako, I was born in Panay, in Dumangas, Iloilo. Pero ang isa ko ka-brother, si Mano, sa Barutak to natawo eh. And then, uh, ang lula namon sa mother side, Parkon, from Pututan. Oo. So, ang father ko, muna, Resurrection, Parkon, Buena Flor. Si Lola Irenia Villanueva, amotong na asawa ni Lolo Victorino sa first wife kami sa kay Irenia. So, muna siya ang istorya. So, kami, nagpamindanaw kami. Siguro, na-remember ko due to economic dislocation. Eh. Walang-wala kami sa Panay. Eh. So, sa una na muna ako sa Mitsayap. Ang parents ko nag-set up business, transportation, rice mill, Talagang big time, pero ups and downs sa business. So, nag-open up ang Alamada. Dito naman kami nag-start business with 200 pesos capital sa mama ko, last, last savings. So, after that, we strive and then we, we graduated all of us. So, I think, mula na siguro mambal ko kay Basip Damo Paiban Magambal. Damo, good salamat. Ang call, happy birthday. Ha? I think two years ago, I attended the reunion of the same group. One morning, I was with Toto Wans in front of the mirror. And then I looked at him and I made a joke in terms of my reaction. Siling ko siya, Toto Wans, ano si Krito mo? Nga nga hasta subong. Huwag na ganipis buhok mo, kagwa'y nagaitom, ah, huwag nagaputi. Sabat niya siling niya. Simple lang. Johnson Oil. So, that was it. But the message behind this, that with that uh, appearance, being young, at the age of 80 plus is really a gift from God. One time or the other week, 
we have couples who celebrated their 50th wedding anniversary. And in that celebration, the, celebrate, the celebrant was the nephew of the couple. And during the homily, he said, I am very thankful because we have this couple who have reached 50 years of being a married and successful husband and wife. This is the wealth of the church. Having parents who have been strong in terms of their relationship for 50 years. And he added, this is also the wealth of the family. Having father and mother with his AIDS, more than 80, and had lived together a strong fa uh, father and mother in the community. So I would like to pick up this point that to ones is the wealth of the family. In terms of health, because he had, he is demonstrating the kind of lifestyle in which a person could live long. And more so, I would like to thank that his lifestyle and the kind of head of the family is the wealth of our family because he had been a good husband, a good father to his sons and daughters. So this is, we may say, could be a contagious lifestyle because at this time we're in family relationship is so we may say fragmented we have this kind of people who would live the Christian virtues Christian attitudes in order that young boys and young girls should look up in order that they could copy and then live as well this life so to you um, to ones thank you very much I am privileged to be your brother-in-law. In the first place, I would want to thank somebody up there for all the things that happened today. And I am very thankful that you have spent a part of your life some hours with us, and I hope we will have more years to celebrate together. Thank you very much, and good luck. Living for the moment. Oh, don't stop. Celebrate the fears. Grow up. You're living for the moment. I don't stop. Cause the break of feelings.
Thank you.